Teufel IBT IELTS Speaking Test Next Generation Sanai A Porker Page eighteen Question forty nine Explain how birthdays are celebrated in your country. We have two types of birthday celebrations in my country. Indoor party and outdoor party. In outdoor party, usually friends or family members take the person who is holding the birthday party out to a restaurant. They usually have a cake in the restaurant and the waiters come and sing Happy birthday to you. Then they cut the cake and distribute it among the guests and all the friends and members of the family give their gifts to the person and uh, after that they usually come home for dinner party at night. Another kind of celebration is held inside the house. Guests get invitation card and come to the party. In the party usually there is a music group that plays music and everybody dances. When the dancing party is almost over they usually bring the cake that is decorated with candles. The person <coughs> blows the candles out and cuts the cake and distributes it among the guests. Again she or he gets gifts from friends and members of the family and everybody sings happy birthday to you. Then music starts and after that they dance a little. Late at night they have dinner and after that they go home. Question 50 Some students would rather write a paper than take a test. Other students would rather take a test instead of writing a paper. Which option do you prefer and why? I myself like to write a paper. I think it is easier. First of all, you have got a lot of time. You are, n you are not under pressure. For example, uh, there is no deadline. One uh, one uh, math deadline or two month deadline and you can manage your time. When you are writing a paper you have access to different sources. You can go to library and uh, surf 
the internet. You can also ask your professor or your friends to give you some ideas. And when you are writing a paper, you come to study a lot of things and you learn many things. But if I'm going to take a test, I have to cram for the exam and just study the part that is necessary for exam. I just try to memorize everything for exam and later I forget all about. I have to wait through lots of materials that I am not interested in. Question 51. Who is your favorite teacher? Why? My favorite teacher is my music teacher. He teaches me harmonica. He is an old man with a young soul. He is an experienced teacher and he is very tolerant of my mistakes. So he never becomes tired of repeating a lesson. His class is always amusing for me. So when I am learning I don't understand how time flies. Question 52 what is your favorite pastime? My favorite pastime is uh, surfing the net. I really enjoy going through different sites and gathering lots of data about my favorite singer and her new songs. On the other hand, I can get the newest news and enhance my general knowledge about various topics. This way I feel my time is being used fruitfully. Question 53 how do you like to spend your leisure time? Choose a leisure activity and explain why you like to do it. Actually, I am very busy because I go to work and also I study. But if I can get any t free time my pastime is uh, reading novels. I like it very much. When I am reading a novel, I get to know a lot of things. I learn many things. I study most of the novels in English because it helps me to improve my grammar and also to add lots of vocabularies to my archive. I can get familiar with new style of writing. When I am reading a book, especially a novel, I fantasize myself as uh, the as uh, the protagonist of the story. I enjoy it very much. Therefore, I never feel how time flies. Question number 54. 
Which city in the world would you like to visit? There are many cities in the world that I like to be there or to visit, but my favorite city in the world is Venice in Italy. A nice city, you know. Everybody knows it is located in water and people commute with the help of boats. The styles and structures of the houses are very fantastic and beautiful. Now, the beauty is uh, breathtaking. If I live in the city, I can enjoy lots of sports, especially water sports. For example, I can ride my boat to go shopping. Or sometimes I can open the window of my house and start catching a fish. It is fantastic. Question 55. What is uh, the most interesting class you have ever taken? Explain the aspects of the class that made it interesting. My favorite class is my music class. I like this class very much. My music teacher is someone special. He is very skilled. The way that he teaches music is unique. The way that his fingers touch the strings of the violin is totally different. So you can see where and when the fingers come toward the strings and how the sound comes out. It is a very attractive class and you never feel how the time flies.